an airman's journey gives a unique look at the military. From his enlistment in the U.S. Air Force in 1947 at Fort Benning, Georgia, through a 25-year career as an airman ending in 1972, Robert M. Fletcher, Sr. writes about these important years in American history and how they impacted his life. Spanning the decades following World War II and ending during the Vietnam War, his memoir is told in personal photos and prose, offering a first-hand view. It has been a life well lived. Now 84 years young, Fletcher wants his life to be recorded for his sons and their families. He also believes that his book will be of interest to other veterans. Fletcher rose through the ranks of the Air Force to retire as a major with full honors. Says the author, I have been very fortunate. I have two successful sons with great families. I am now the oldest in the family of 13 brothers and sisters, as there are only four of us left. After retiring from the Air Force, I taught at Fort Walton High School, Florida, for 23 years. I taught mostly physics, also math, earth science, physical science, and meteorology. He says, as Frank Sinatra once sang, I did it my way. To learn about the greatest generation who grew up during the Great Depression and World War II, read Always a New Adventure, available at Amazon.com and other online retailers, as well as directly from the publisher.